Since the deadly fire in Old Montreal on October 4th, Montreal police say they've had 200 investigators working on the case. Now it has paid off. They say they've arrested two men. Police say they have a 20-year-old suspect in custody for allegedly having set the fire. And another 18-year-old man is suspected of having driven the getaway car. The suspects are known to police and were arrested in the boroughs of Saint Laurent and Mercier Chalaga Maisonneuve, where police also searched one of their homes. The SPVM says the foul is now in the hands of the prosecutors. A decision on the charge will be known within the next 24 hours. Video obtained by Radio Canada showed a masked suspect kicking in a door shortly before the fire started on the main floor of the three-story building. A second video showed a suspect taking photos. We know there is somebody called shot, so we want to, to get at uh, this person for sure. The flames spread quickly upstairs to what was a hostel. 25 people were in the building at the time. Two never made it out alive, a mother and her seven-year-old daughter, both French citizens. Earlier this week, Quebec's chief coroner ordered an inquiry into the fire at the request of the public security minister. It will be the second coroner's inquiry into a suspicious fire at an old Montreal building in just over a year and a half. In March of 2023, a fire in the building on Place du Vel killed seven people. Both buildings are owned by the same person. Police say that 2023 fire was also intentionally set, but there have been no arrests in that case so far. Given the similarities, the coroner could eventually decide to combine both investigations.